I'm completely co up with myself. Mm. And I am right now staying in Usman University Hostel. Mm. So financially, my facility and hostel facility is provided by the university. Mm. And I'm getting scholarship for myself also. Mm. So I'm able to co myself. So you are both in private and government organizations. Yes, sir. What is the similarity and the difference between both organizations? Similarity is the one thing, sir. Uh, whether it is private or government, you need to discharge your duties. That I absorb from that. Uh, government sector offers us uh, a kind of public exposure. Whatever the department offers a kind of public exposure when compared to the private sector, sir. In compliance software job, your public exposure is very less, very, very less. But I observed, and for me, public exposure is needed. I love to be with the people, I love to contact with the people more. So, that is the difference and the similarities as well. Duties should be delivered, whether it is a private sector or government sector. And I don't think private sector you need to work hard, whether the government sector also need to work harder. You need to deliver your discharge. I work in a service sector where I have to deliver my duties from 9 to 2 o'clock of the duties. So there is no chance to escape from the duties. In the private sector also, the same. You will be given a project, you have to deliver your duties. You have to complete the project within the deadline. So similarity is what should be discharged whether it is government or private sector. But the reason you told us uh, regarding uh, resigning your post question job, uh, you don't have much public exposure and uh, yes, the work is not challenging. Uh, yes, sir. You don't have much work also and you are a hard working person. Yes, sir. You want to be always busy. Mm -hmm. So, no such kind of atmosphere in uh, post assistant. Postal assistant, my job is completely desk job, sir. It doesn't afford me field, field job in any case. What do you mean by field? Field job means interacting with the people or the whatever the work you, you will be allocated. Mm -hmm. You go there and and collect the, collect the data. In this kind, the people will, then just will come to you, huh? Just sitting at this, people will come to you for the, their own work. Huh? Yes, sir. I will deliver my duties, which are not of my choice. The duties are already defined there. I have to just uh, deliver my duties. It doesn't offer a future um, challenges, sir. My duty is speed post booking. I think I don't. I don't think it offers um, creativity and a few more challenges to me. Speed post booking is doesn't require any creativity. It's of regular job, and public exposure is also a little less in that one. Then you have chosen LNB. What made you choose LNB? Yes, sir. In in my three years service in the department of post, I felt that legal knowledge is necessary to survive in the department to discharge our duties better. So after resigning my job, I decided to take LNB as my uh, career, apart from being uh, completely preparing for SSC CGL exam, which, which gives me, which benefits me to discharge my duties well after joining another department now. And I am interested in that one. In LLB? Yes, sir. Okay. Right now you are in which year? Right now I am in first year, first semester, sir. First year, first semester. Yes, sir. Okay, you are the state first time. Yes, sir. I am the first time on the college time. Oh, okay. What is the full form of LLB? What is constitution? Constitution is a, a document or a document uh, to rule our country, which is a set of rules to rule our, our country. It is a primary document, primary documents, which contains a set of rules to define or to discharge duties by the government as well it gives guidelines to the people of India. Now, what is the difference between constitution, act of parliament and rules? Constitution, act of parliament and rules. Oh, acts, of par acts are made by the parliament sir by taking the guidelines of the constitution. Acts will be made according to the constitution rules. If any act should not violate the constitution, the rules mentioned in the constitution. The rules are next to the power, uh, acts. Acts should be obeyed by the people as well as the government. 
roots are doesn't have legal obligation when compared to that. What is Nirbhaya Act? Nirbhaya Act it is an act made to protect women of India after the incident of the Delhi rape case, December 2012. Uh, has some provisions uh, define what is the rape actually. First, it defines what is the rape. The word rape is previously not defined. That. What is the definition of rape is not exact before that. It was the whole it defined what is the rape. According to that, the definition is the definition includes giving, teasing, and voyeurism. And apart from that, following a woman to, to disturb her, all these included under the rape, definition of the rape. And it included some more sections. I do not remember actually. So even teasing itself is a teasing. Teasing, teasing, not teasing actually, voyeurism and following uh, and video recording are uh, without her consent comes under rape right now. Yes, we can go for quick look at it in one video. Okay. So, yes. Okay. First thing is, whenever you are not confident, don't give the answers. Like the rape and other offenses, these come under the definition of other offenses. The definition of rape is what God did. Previously, it was, uh, I mean, uh, well, if there is an entropos, that was the way. Now it was been voided. That's it. Right? So, but however, these offenses are being classified as other offenses. So they do not come under the so that's be clear with that. And the second thing is, the fundamental things such as constitutional law, so constitution being the supreme authority of the land, right? every law has to be subordinate to the constitution. From there flows the parliamentary laws, from there flows the executive rules. So, so try to have the difference between uh, those fundamentals should not be done in mistake. Because you being first rank in uh, LLB, you, you shall not do those fundamental mistakes. So. I was asking you the provision of LLB actually. LLB actually, being I, first. We had the discussion three days ago in our classroom. But I couldn't, I couldn't get the answer actually. Okay. One of my friends asked me that question already. And regarding the uh, language is fine and the uh, work experience well, you have to just see what because what happened is you are done a BTEC. In line with BTEC you are joining a technology. You left the job thinking that you are a better student for the government sector. Then you join the government sector. In between you left it. Then you join in a LLB where the opportunities in government is very high. So then uh, you are again right for the addition. So stability. The stability matters. So you should be able to properly justify it. And your father is a farmer. You cannot afford to because you are saying that okay, right now I am having savings, I can survive for another one or two years. Yes. But if the job in SAC is ensured, they can ask you why you have left the job as such. You have taken a leave. Think on those lines. And uh, when we were asking about Nalgunda, you were saying about uh, Boratnagar and Nalgunda, those things are not required. You be prepared for your soya pet and Nalgunda. So, what is the historical importance? What is the economical importance? Geographically, how it is placed? Those things. Because once you told two things you particularly told is one is cement industry and second thing is uh, fluoride. That's why I try to ask you on cement industry. Where are it is focused in Nalgonda alone? There are so many places in Telangana. Why not in other places? Why in Nalgonda only? Because there is a raw material supply. So you have to see all those things. And I have not insisted on fluoride. Otherwise, I would have insisted on what is fluoride and how it can be eradicated on those. So those things just see once. And um, I can just browse once regarding such and stuff. But if there are any things. Sir, I just wanted to delete that one, sir. Uh, yes, mine. Yes, but these things you have already submitted. No, sir. We have not submitted anything. You have, while filling your main submission form, you have already submitted. Yes, sir. These things are developed at the time of filling. Yes, sir. Oh, okay. So, so if you don't want, you can. Uh, I just want to make sure it's only three months. Uh, yeah, yes, sir. That's all. That's all. That's all. That's all. That's all.
Yes. Unless otherwise you tell them, nobody knows it. No? Yes. So those things are okay. And uh, the, regarding the LLB and uh, those things, because what happens is once you say you have won a prize, particularly in LLB, you are saying you are the state first time, and SIID, you are saying that you are uh, state first time, there are some district first time, yes. and in chess you are saying some first time family competitions and all those things. So once you are saying that I am a topper in that particular category. The questions also will be like that. Okay. If you say I am having an exposure, the questions will be different. If you are saying I am the topper in that category, the questions will be different. And the answers also will be putting more qualitative answers. So we will just see whether we can uh, give all those things at the time of uh, interview. If at all you are fully confident, you can give those things. That's not a problem. But uh, go to once. Hmm? Already I gave you my feedback. Yes, sir. Anything? Yeah, important thing I was so you appeared very tense to me initially when you started. Yeah, I'm very tense. But later, you are relaxed. I myself identified that in the first one or two minutes, I become tense. Yeah, and second thing is you are too relaxing. I mean, it's more of like a, it's an obtuse angle which is coming up between your there is a clear change which is observed. So it means always try to maintain 90 degrees or just up to 100 degrees your body portion. Don't go beyond like this. So for example, if you saw this, I mean, sir, how he is sitting from the beginning. So you need to maintain that straight posture. So it's like you appeared more relaxed by the end. By the end, yes, I. Initially you were very tense and by the end you you are very irritated, very too relaxed. So my comfort should be same. Maintain the same, the same, same comfort or this particular no, same. If you are comfortable only, we have asked about your own district. That's yes. why I have asked you to tell me about uh, my own district. So that you are well aware of those things. No? And I said, okay, you will get uh, a bit relaxed. Yes. Not an issue. Okay. So your interview is relatively, uh, there is a lot of improvement. But fake. Yes, sir, I think at any time, sir, it's like last year was the uh, most two days ago and I couldn't put anything in this uh, last two days. I will prepare those areas which I mentioned in the letter. Okay, I'll do this. Thank you, sir.